so good day everyone now i want to show you how to use obs and, and, and canva and um usdc so you can come here click on start recording so i've clicked on start recording that's why it is that's why it has started so can you see this pause button just click it to pause so there are also different things you can do settings so hot keys so you can set the key that you want the combination of keys that you want to, like for example if you notice my tutorial videos i don't have to come to obs to click start recording before it starts recording i just have to press shift f1 because i have set it so click and set the keys that you want for specific instructions so i click shift f1 to start shift f1 to stop and to pause and unpause shift f2 shift f2 very easy f2 means function 2 that's the, those are the function keys so there are different things you can actually do here just try to play around with this thing and don't mess with the settings too that's something else so now when you are done recording the files will be somewhat like this so can you see dot mv m m k v dot m k v dot m k v so you have to remox it so to remox it you click on file remox recordings Come here, click on these three dots, click on it, then go to where those um, recordings are, which will obviously be in videos, something like this. Then click it, click open, then click remox. So, can you see that recording remox? So, come here, you'll be able to see it. Can you see dot mp4? So I've remoxed the recording. So that's it. And to add your video cam, but my own camera is not good. I don't know maybe it's because I did not clean it. I'm actually getting. So you can actually click this plus, then decide what you want to add. So you can add your own video capture device, Windows capture, which is already here. Then you can add so many things game capture so you can actually record yourself playing game so that's it about um, obs so now let me show you how to use canva so go to your browser make sure you are connected to the internet type canva.com this is my profile so in case you have not created um, your account create an account and click create a design click presentation okay i'm not connected to the internet funny i said make sure you're connected to the internet and i wasn't even connected to the internet so that's if you want to create that a presentation which is 16 ratio 9 in case you don't know what 16 ratio 9 is is like when your phone for example when your phone is like slant they call it i think landscape on phone so that's how it's a display so it is loading let's give it a minute so there are different templates you can choose from instead of creating from scratch you can decide to create from scratch so your designs can actually be unique and you can also use templates So can you see different templates you can choose from? So can you see different templates you can choose from? So this one is 26, this one is 21. So let's choose this one first. Let's see how it will be. So can you see 
so everything is already done for you all you have to do is just what edit so let's click this one first this is the first page so can you see practical home maintenance all i have to do is just what edit it so double click on to can you see can turn into just explain can you see very 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 simple so you can select the one you want to add next so click plus so that it will be on the fresh page and click the one you want to add next so can you see and please for god's sake i might actually say this in every video i make please do not share my tutorial videos if you want, if you want anybody to have it it's just one thousand now let the person message me and buy it and please do not sell i feel sue you for that one now. so that's just it you just have to keep adding and keep typing just putting what you want to put so now let me talk about BSDC. Let me how will I do this one? Okay. Let me record something first. Where's my sound recorder? Okay, voice recorder. Click. So this one, I just want to record my voice and, you know, put a picture on the background. It's still loading. Sorry about that. So can you see it? So just click record. I don't know, you might use your phone. So, um, recording. I don't, I don't think that's going to start it. Okay, so let me close my browser since I've explained Canva. So I couldn't record, I don't know, maybe it's because this one is actually active. So let me open VSDC video editor. So let's assume I've actually recorded something. Okay, took it a minute to load. So just cancel this one. Click new project. Can you see new project here? So project title, just type the title of the project, maybe um let me just say audio book sample. Then finish. So can you see it? So all I have to do is what? Drag the audio I want here and drag the picture I want here. So now let's go to where I can find the. So this is the audio. Let me just choose one. Let me choose. Um, yeah. Laptop is open. Sorry about that. Okay, so let me just say this is the audio I recorded, which is not but just representation. So this is how it will be. Now let me pick a picture. So let me pick a picture for my Canva designs. I designed all these things with Canva. Let me increase it so I'll be able to see all of them. I designed all the things with Canva. Canva, 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 Canva. So let me choose this one. So you just drag it or tab drop it so can you see it so now when i play oh, 
Sorry about that. Way too loud. I mean, you can also increase or reduce the audio here. So this is me reducing the audio. So let's try it now. So let's just assume that the song that is playing in the background is actually your audio that you recorded. So after that, you can actually edit this one. You can resize it anyhow you want. If you want to. You can resize it anyhow you want if you want to. Then go to export project, click to MP4 to MP4. You can see to MP4 or for Instagram or for YouTube. But I used to MP4, so you click it to MP4. There are so many things you can actually do in edit profile, but I wouldn't talk about that. So click after I click to MP4, click export project. Then to bring this one out, click continue. So you see it here, zero percent. That started exporting. You just give it a minute. So you, you can actually leave it and come back though. So now you see conversion was completed. Click OK. Now can you see where it was saved? Videos. It was saved in videos. You can actually change where you want to save it, but I prefer it saved in videos. So I'll just go to vid videos and I'll be able to see it somewhere. What's the name? audio book sample audio book okay can you see it now let's click enter so you can play so can you see it so that's how it's play and when you want to use picture, use a good picture. So I hope you understand that and I hope it's something I'll be able to do on our own. I know some people will be talking about me not explaining how to install the applications. I believe installing applications shouldn't be a problem for you. Because installing an application is just like the f one of the first things you should know how to do before you learn how to use a computer or while learning how to use a computer. So, thank you. My name is Ezekiel. And, um, well, I noticed that maybe some people don't know how to use, um, PowerPoint. If you don't know how to use PowerPoint to create your presentation, you can just use Canva like how I taught you. So PowerPoint is actually easy. Canva too is easy. So you can use any of the two. Canva has more designs than PowerPoint, but I use both. So we're still on information marketing. My name is Ezekiel. Thank you.